Hello Minions, Wheezy here, and welcome to another weekly wrap-up. I'm getting these things going. Um, so, I'm going to cover some things this week, what we got posted to the channel. Um, I'm going to adjust my camera a little bit if I can. I'm not quite framed where I want to be. I was going to stop the video and then start over again, but you know what? We'll just do it. Because, you know, Wheezy's weekly wrap-up. Not well thought out. <laughs> so, uh, we're going to go through what went on this week, and this time... I'm going to cut and include some clips of things so you guys can actually see a little bit of what I post, especially the unlisted stuff. So first, let me just click over here and go through my content. So since the last weekly wrap-up, what are th some things that got posted to the channel? Um, I actually had a few videos posted publicly to the channel this week. Uh, the first one I referred to in the last weekly wrap-up, which is my video on the best defensible areas for free-for-all in Cold War. So I went through every map in Cold War free-for-all and broke down the best defensible areas for that. So here's a quick clip from that. If you get a few kills behind this rock and you notice that people are starting to turn their attention towards you immediately, <laughs> then um, you can move. Uh, the way that I move is first over to this uh, little fenced in corner here um, because as people push back towards the rock, you will be able to catch them from behind or typically looking at where you just were. Um, all right, so. Go check that out. As usual, links for all of the stuff that I talk about in this video is going to be in the description below, as well as everything being posted on wheezysgaming.com. So you can always go check that out to see stuff as soon as it's posted as well there. Um, so after Defensible Areas, I posted a video of Star Wars Squadrons. Um, the Xbox Game Pass had a free-to-play weekend for squadrons last weekend so I jumped on that and played a little bit and I actually had a surprising amount of fun with that game uh, so I kind of took my gameplay in that and kind of cut it all together into a into kind of an abbreviated mashup so here's a good clip from that video oh you didn't realize you had an ace on your tail bruh where you at yes sir who's next you got more just shooting at the ground to threaten you so you know what's up so yeah that game was surprisingly fun go check that video out if you're interested in uh, interested in it <laughs> uh, what else uh, publicly to the channel we'll just stick with that I created my first short so I got kind of this wild hair there was a moment in Cold War that really just kind of epitomized how Cold War makes me feel and YouTube has started pushing these kind of like shorts which is like vertical oriented videos that are less than 30 or 60 seconds um, and so I created one of those and honestly I posted it didn't get much traction and then apparently like overnight over the last two days it's gotten like 800 views um, so you guys can go check that out if you want that's the only these shorts if I keep playing around with them are the only thing that I'm not really posting to wheeziesgaming.com just because they're YouTube short things. They do show up on the channel though, uh, so you can check that out. Again, comment is in the description below. Um, comment. A link is in the description below. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to show you a clip just because the whole thing is like 15 seconds. Um, I uh, Let's see, what else did I do? Those are all the unlisted ones. I'll talk about those in a second. Ah, yes. Yesterday, I posted a head-to-head, -head, which one is better, uh, Call of Duty Cold War or Call of Duty Modern Warfare. What I did is I sat down, I just started recording, I played one game of Kill Confirmed in Cold War, I launched Modern Warfare, and then I played one game of Kill Confirmed in Modern Warfare. So you just kind of see back-to-back, -back, not just how they play, but also how the kind of experience of how it feels to play it. So like, I find that that's kind of one of the most important things in video games for me especially, it isn't necessarily the tangible things that you can really well this and this and this, but the way that you feel playing the game. And I still feel like I'm having a lot of fun in Modern Warfare, and Cold War still kind of frustrates me a little bit more. And by a little bit more, I mean significantly more. So uh, here's a here's a little clip from that. Are you kidding me? Let's watch this. This is that shit. Getting shot in the face by an AK does not disturb your aim at all with a sniper rifle. That seem all right to you guys. Okay, so yeah, go check that out. Uh, I think that's a that's a probably a pretty entertaining one to watch. Um, this week, I actually just got them all kind of posted this morning, which is to say they've been on the channel, but I've been waiting to kind of process them and get them officially posted and linked to wheeziesgaming.com. Is new episodes of both Valhalla and uh, Jedi Fallen Order. So I went ahead. I'm uploading a second episode. I'm uploading episode 16 of Valhalla right now. 
Um, but I already posted uh, episode 15 of Valhalla. Um, so that's up. Uh, here's a clip from that one. Huh? Oh, you're still preparing it. It sounded like I was already drinking. Oh, what the fuck? The elixir is ready. It will taste like misery itself, but it will open your mind. I to watched you spit in my food, lady. The nine words. I did you a favor. How dare you? And that's leading into episode 16, which I guess will be on the next weekly wrap-up. I'll be posting that hopefully uh, later today or tomorrow, so it'll go live. You guys can see it at wheeziesgaming.com, or it'll show up in the playlists on the channel. Um, and that one is actually going to take you into Valhalla. Okay, Assassin's Creed Valhalla is finally taking us into Valhalla. Um, so that's been, that's been a nice little change for Valhalla. Um, Jedi Fallen Order has actually started to get into what feels like the meat of the story and I've really been loving it. So I got two episodes. I got episodes 15 and 16 posted uh, this morning. Um, so you guys can check those out. Episode 15, uh, I'll show you a clip from that. Tell Grace to get the mantis running. What's happening? Zombie apocalypse. God, Grace don't, the no, don't, no. Ah. Okay, here we go. Oh, boo. Hey, oh. Oh yeah. And then episode 16 really felt like I felt like really like a badass and I got my new pink lightsaber. Uh, and so here's a clip from that. All right, what's the what's the spinny attack? There it is. Oh, 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 face my pink fury, you bitch! Oh god, please don't shoot at me, big gunship. Hold on, here we go. Holy god! Oh my god, I am so badass now. I can't even stand it. <laughs> oh my god, yes, that fabulous hair, Cal. So yeah, I have I have been I have been feeling the pull to go back to uh, Star Wars. I actually uh, recorded another episode this morning, and the story is still pretty fantastic. This one is actually like I played for like 50 minutes, and it is like jam packed with like cutscenes and fight scenes and awesome stuff. So that's going to be episode 17. That's that'll be posted sometime this upcoming week. But yeah, Fallen Order is really hitting its stride, uh, and I'm enjoying it. So that's kind of what I've done this week. Um, I didn't really address it last week, but some of you may have noticed that I also kind of went through an upgrade thing with my camera here. So this is part of my own personal like photography stuff that I do on the side. But that said, I got a new camera that I can also use to record these videos, and it's much better than uh, my old one. So let's actually let's actually see if we can let's do studio mode and do a smooth transition here. Um, this is my new camera, and those of you who remember my old camera. This is just a webcam, and so it's um, not nearly as great as a uh, fancy camera. Fancy camera is <laughs> is much nicer. Um, and being a photographer, uh, that kind of stuff matters to me. Oh God, I just hadoukened my my microphone. So anyway, anything else going on? Uh, yeah, works. Work in real life has still been busy. So, but I did did find some time to play some games this week. Um, not entirely sure what's coming up. I'm honestly kind of looking forward to hopefully getting access to some new games at some point. I'm, I'm like playing Squadrons kind of gave me that itch for like wanting to get back into wanting to get back into some new games. Like just playing new games for the last few years, actually. Like part of being on like my break, like dying from Wheezy's Gaming, is uh, I kind of stopped picking up new games. Like playing with my friends and Call of Duty kind of died off and then I was just like oh I'm not going to spend $60 for a new game when I'm kind of busy and so then by the time I'm playing games they've already been out of you I mean look I'm playing Jedi Fallen Order that came out what two years ago <laughs> but uh so I'm I'm getting back into that rhythm where I'm excited about new games I want to get some new games and I want to play those new games as they come out Valhalla is like the first kind of 
the new game I've played like as it launched and I'm not disliking it, but man, it's it's kind of feeling like a slog. So anyway, um, this will be the part where I throw it to you guys for some feedback. Uh, tell me what you guys think about what I posted, what you'd like to see, what you like, what you don't like. Um, what do you guys think of my short? You guys think I should do more shorts? Or is it? I don't. I don't know. I mean, it was. It reminds me, and those of you who've been around a while may remember, because it's still out there. It still exists, and it's actually still, I think, somewhere linked on my main channel page. The, the Uber amalgamation, right? You guys remember that? That's where I, that was an entire channel dedicated to posting like short kind of clips like this. Um, that's still out there. I haven't, I haven't posted anything to it literally in years, but the shorts kind of feel a lot like that. Like taking what was fun about posting short little moments to the Uber amalgamation. Um, but then it's just a short on here. So I don't know. Thoughts. Tell me what you guys think. Uh, that's it for me for now. I'm going to try and keep from rambling on these if I can avoid it because I'm really great at rambling. So that's it. I'll talk to you minions later. Goodbye.